Hi all, so this is the uh, brand new Ruckus uh, ICX7150-C12P. Um, so I just got this in the mail, so I thought I would unbox it and uh, show you what it looks like. So the first thing you notice here is this is the first box that says Ruckus on it, right? All of our previous switch boxes all said brocade, uh, so we are now shipping them that say Ruckus. So let's open this up and have a look. All right, so well packaged so far. Here's the accessory kit. We'll have a look at that in a second. And here's our switch, nicely packaged. Here's some plastic. So let me get this out of the way. So, here's our switch, uh, 12 ports of PoE. So PoE is capable on all 12 ports, which is nice. There is a uh, traditional console cable right here, so RG45 to serial console. Um, and there is also the uh, USB Type-C. So this is the first time that we've offered a USB Type-C on this device. Um, there is the out-of-band port, of course, RG45 and the USB for a USB flash drive to load code and backup configurations, etc. cetera. Um, it says Ruckus on the switch, so as opposed to Brocade, this is the first time, and we see the model number ICX7150-C12P. Um, on this side, we see the uplink ports, so the two RJ45 uplinks, and then the two SFPs. So these guys could be uh, one gig or 10 gig. This particular model is licensed for one gig, uh, but you can upgrade those just easily with, to 10 gigs. So you can buy the license, um, and there's no license file to, to uh, install on this model. You just agree to the terms and conditions and say that you bought the license, um, and that's it. And they'll, they'll, they'll be operational for 10 gig. Uh, there's also the status symbol. So by pushing the button here, it'll, sh it'll show you the real-time status of the switch. Um, there's a reset. So... You know, if you want to reboot the switch, you can press the reset with a, with a paper clip or a pin. Uh, on the back side, we see that there is, you know, the traditional um, 100, well, 100 to 140 volt uh, power connector. Uh, there's also a Kensington lock thing. So if you're putting, putting this in a library or school or, or somewhere uh, where it's not monitored, you could lock it down to a desk or, or whatever the case to, with a Kensington lock. Um, we see a sticker with its MAC address on the back, um, but that's it. Fairly straightforward. It is, there's no fans, of course, right? This is fanless, so it's totally silent when you plug it in. On the side, we see a couple of different rack mount uh, options. So it, uh, you could use a two-post rack, a four-post rack. There's a magnet mount that goes on the bottom, etc. Uh, there's a wall mount. We also see there is um, some cutouts for, for a mount here. If you wanted to mount it on the wall like this um, and it also will come with feet so we'll look at that in a second but that's where the feet go if you want to put it on a desk which is probably the most common way um, on the bottom we see the the, the model number serial number uh, and also the license id should you need that uh, to purchase a license okay so put that down we'll have a look at the accessory kit here So it comes with, uh, in my case, a US, uh, a U.S. power cord or U.S. Canada. So just traditional uh, C13. We get an RJ45 to uh, serial to, to DB9 serial console cable. Uh, it does not come with that USB Type C console cable. So you can buy those. I bought two of them off of Amazon for ten bucks. So those are easy to come by. Uh, but it, it comes with the traditional RJ45 to serial console. Uh, we have the connector for the power to hold the power plug in. So if I can get this bag open here. So this is just a clip. It goes in the back side of the switch. Uh, right here, just to hold the power cord. So it'll lock the power cord in there. 
All right. So that's that. Uh, and then lastly, uh, we have the feet here. So those are the rubber feet, should you wish to use those and put it on a desk. Uh, and then we just have some warnings, right? So, so there's a, there's a um, toxic substance elements table, mm -hmm. uh, how to download software and software updates. So this does come with a lifetime warranty. So as long as you own the device, it's next business day advanced replacement. Um, and it also has lifetime software uh, upgrades and, and, and uh, patches. Uh, and then there's a wall mount, so if you wanted to, a, a template, if you wanted to, to uh, drill it into the wall, it's got a template there. But otherwise, that's about it. So pretty nice little switch. Um, it's nice that it's silent. You can have it running right beside your desk. Um, runs the same software as all the other 7150s. And um, so once we get the, the routing code and the stacking code, you'll be able to stack these up to 12 high and do full routing on them. But that's it for today. Thanks for joining. See you next time.